tonight, leaving behind new evidence of atrocities. In Piski Rukitsky, we were taken to a house of horrors. These marks. Inside this tiny cramped room, detainees say they were beaten, shot, and many appear to have their teeth pulled out by Russian troops. This gruesome box of teeth discovered by the team in the yard outside. Alexander is deputy head of the team looking into possible war crimes. He says in practically every town there were such places where people were brought in for interrogation and torture. It's hard to imagine it getting any worse, but today the investigators got a tip on a suspected mass grave. Hidden deep in the woods near Barova, the forensic teams unearthed this, a torture pit dug into the ground and buried in a shallow grave at the bottom, they discovered two bodies. Both were wearing civilian clothes, handcuffed, shot, and one had their skull caved in. The team fear there are multiple more bodies buried nearby. And this is the real story of Russia's war in Ukraine. David, investigators here in Kharkiv say more than 530 civilian bodies have been discovered in this region so far, and worrying signs of what appears to be a deliberate campaign of torture by the Russians to terrorize the population into submission. David? Just extraordinary, Ian Panel, our thanks to you and the team again tonight.